What does it take to make a, a successful wedding photographer? So when I say successful, I'm not talking about being booked every week. Well, I'm not talking about uh, being in a position where you are uh, sought after and um, and I think a lot of the times we look to being booked as a sense of validation. I remember when I was shooting 50, 60 weddings a year, if I had a weekend off, I was pretty depressed about it because like, what's wrong with me? I didn't get a wedding for this week. Now it's a little different because I only shoot 20 a year. I'm like, cool, I've got the weekend off and I can go and you know, watch my kids playing sport and I can enjoy some sort of normality in, in, in my life. So what is success? Success to you is probably very different to what success is to me, but there are three fundamental things that are going to make you successful. First of all, the thing that nobody can copy, and that is you as your brand, the brand that is you. Now, right now, you are exuding a brand. You are exuding a brand. As you sit there, there are so many things that are involved. It's, it's body language, it's posture, it's the way you dress, it's the way you smell, it's, it's, uh, your, it's your general appearance, it's the way you speak to people. There are so many things that constitute a brand. And you need to live your brand. You need to be aware of everything that you do is then brand representative because you are selling yourself to your clients. Your product, Obviously, your product needs to be of a very good standard, but your product could be replicated. I mean, I could, I could shoot like you, you could shoot like me, in terms of the actual finished image. You can, you can study to know how to photograph something. So your product can be uh, emulated and your service can be, can be matched. Your brand that is you, that's what's going to differentiate yourself. And so much of that has to do with, uh, with confidence.